Okay, so lovely to be here today with you from the ATD Best Awards in Washington, D.C. Yes, I'm out and about traveling again, and I have had the most fantastic day. Really warm welcome from the ATD community, and amazing to see so many international faces here, and great to be traveling from Australia, of course, for the conference. What I really love about the Best Conference is its organizations giving you an insight into what they're doing within their organizations and they are the best. So they've all won awards with the ATD and the awards ceremony is gonna be happening this evening. So I wanna just share with you Rita Bailey, who is the ex-CLO of Southwest Airlines, and of course their reputation precedes them in terms of their culture and their achievements, shared with us about her career today and how she sees the need for disruption and challenge, sharing that Southwest Airlines was one of the very early disruptors within their industry and getting us to think about how we need to disrupt within learning and development within our organizations. I then went to a session with Joshua Carver from Western Union. Joshua was sharing with us how he and his team have helped change the way they do performance reviews at Western Union. And I was so inspired of us, Joshua, to do an interview with us for the blog so I can share that with our community. He has gone, helped his team go from annual performance reviews to really effective quarterly empowerment conversations. And he had some great stats and figures and a really interesting business case. It's the amount of money that's actually saved the business and the improved NPS from the, um, from the intervention. So we're really looking forward to sharing that interview with you. I'm going to check my notes. Yes, I then went on to a, a converse, panel conversation about social learning where we had a representative from IBM, from a local construction company, and also from um, one of the largest financial institutions in Taiwan. So a real mix of people sharing how social learning is making an impact within their organizations. Fascinating stuff. Particularly loving the construction company who have a panel of business uh, people within their small organization um, it was now in a panel that you had to apply to be on, and they actually lead the huddle sessions that train the rest of the group. So I love that idea. Also went on to go to a fascinating session about scorecards. And I mean, I love metrics and I love the numbers, but the organization um, that had, this is called Consumer Energy from Michigan, the amount of work that they've done on scorecards was quite phenomenal. And their COLO was such an inspiration. Again, I've invited her to do a, um, interview with me and she's going to be sharing more about scorecards and her measurements and particularly around her behavioral change piece of course which i was fascinated in for their organization so look forward to that one coming soon and finally i went to a session delivered by the verizon team again really inspiring they've done some fantastic work using art cones approach around retention of learning for boosts and bursts and they really delivered some um, key metrics to show the increase that that had given in retention, particularly when you're looking at knowledge-based learning. So a really fascinating conference executed by the ATD team here in Washington. Um, I hope the broader audience gets to come along next year when I'm sure it'll be another great event. So thank you, everyone. Thanks for listening. Look forward to chatting with you soon. Bye.